happening now. Roads are bumper to bumper, though, for the Friday evening rush. But has a new interstate exit made one road too busy? 4029 Jigochi Aloka found out what drivers like you have to say. She's live in Springdale. And the city says about 15,000 cars drive on Don Tyson every day since the interchange has opened. Now, although the interchange has made it a lot easier for people to get to Arvis Ballpark and other places, people who live here say that since the interchange is open, traffic is now a headache. So everybody's coming this way now, and that definitely makes it more traffic for us. The new on and off ramps at Don Tyson Parkway increased traffic, and some say it made the road more dangerous. Cars are just coming off the freeway, so they come in really fast, and it's not safe. Right now, there are no stoplights to slow you down when you get off the interstate and onto Don Tyson, but the city says it's in the works. This is the city's design that shows how they plan on relieving some of the traffic in the near future. They're expanding 56th Street and Don Tyson to four lanes and having it all connect to a roundabout that will be built near the interchange that will also connect to Blue Avenue just north of Highway 412. After the construction, you always see improvement, maybe increased traffic, but it flows easier. And the city says they'll start construction on the roundabout lane expansion by mid August. Live in Springdale, Gochea Loka, 4029 News. And the city says the stoplights on Don Tyson Parkway should be working.